Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining us. My name is Nick. This is my mom, Jen. Hi guys. And we are continuing our Tarantino adventure. This is Inglorious Bastards. Don't so. have to swear. <laughs> oh, and for the record, uh, the way they spelled out Inglorious, G-L-O-U-R-E-S, and then B-A-S-T-E-R-D-S. Uh, yeah, It's right. very unique yeah. spelling. We do, I do like me some Brad Pitt. Yeah, Brad Pitt. Do you know anyone else who's in this? No. So it's, it's an ensemble cast. I mean, Brad Pitt, uh, front and center, but also there's um, Diane Kruger. There's oh. a couple others. And uh, your favorite, Christoph Waltz. So I should point out that uh, Mom and I have... <laughs> uh, uh, Mom has only seen him in The Legend of Tarzan with Alexander Skarsgård and... Uh, Christoph Waltz played Leon Rom, the villain, and horrible, he is horrible. quite despicable character. I mean, yeah. but uh, you know, he's. So it's in... funny how that affects the your view of the yeah. actor, right? So it's like you're that guy. <laughs> you just cringe. I mean, he's an awesome actor. It's <laughs> he, like, oh. Yeah, he's amazing. Yeah. This is the first time I, I ever saw him in a movie, and and his performance here. This is what really made me fall in love with him as a, oh. an actor. Yeah, he, did, he does an incredible job. But it's an ensemble cast. You're going to recognize a lot of actors. Okay, is it war? Is it war? Uh, World War Two? World War Two. Okay. And uh, this, I would say, is my third favorite Tarantino film. Oh. Yeah, first is Kill Bill, second is Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and then third is this. Okay, Once oh. Upon a Time is coming for me. Yeah, that's the the very end. So it's two movies from now. Okay, extremely popular one of his. So yeah. even you know brutal, but it's Brad Pitt. Yeah, it's very entertaining. So yeah, without further ado, let's check it out. I don't know who that is. Sho Shoshana. Is that what Shoshana, that? I think yeah. You you might recognize him when you see him. E. J. Novak, I recognize that name. Yes, from The Office. <laughs> yeah, Mike Myers. That Mike Myers? That Mike Myers. Oh, wow. Oh, more chapters again. He likes chapters. Too. He does, yeah. Once upon a time. Oh, great. He's got a bunch of daughters. That's never good in the mm. old days. Yeah. C'est un plaisir de vous rencontrer, Monsieur Lapadite. Je suis le colonel SS Hans Landa. Oh. There he is. Oh, there he is. Colonel SS Hans Landa, mademoiselle. You recognize oh, her? Yes, yes. Madeline. Oh, from Bond. What's her real name? Um, Leah Sedou. Ah, oh, right. Puisque nous sommes sur une exploitation laitière, je suppose sans risque de me tromper que vous avez du lait? Oui. Alors, je préfère du lait. Très bien. What a difference. We do love our cold milk, don't we? That's exactly what I do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm very stressed not knowing where this is going. <laughs> she knows James Bond. You be careful. Yes. <laughs> well, I did know James Bond. Well, I'm very familiar with you and your family. I have no way of knowing if you are familiar with who I am. Are you aware of my existence? Before the occupation, there were four Jewish families in this area and the Dreyfuses. Is that correct? Somewhere in the last year, it would appear they've vanished, which leads me to the conclusion that they've either made good their escape or someone is very successfully hiding them. And the children, Amos and Shoshana. What was that name? Mm-hmm. Under the floor. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah. Yeah. Oh no. He knows. What are you aware of? That they call you the joint, huh? Precisely. Pour the milk on the floor or something. Heidrich apparently hates the moniker the good people of Prague have bestowed on him. Hmm. Actually, why he would hate the name the hangman's baffling to me. Yeah, Reinhard Heydrich, mm. one of the most evil men the Nazis ever had, and that's saying something. Yeah. I can think like a Jew, where they can only think like a German. Because I'm aware of what tremendous feats human beings are capable of once they abandon dignity. Mm, he knows they're there. <laughs> what the hell is that? That's an enormous pipe. <laughs> Looks like one of those ear trumpets, you know? Oh yeah, the ear horns. Yeah. I might add also that any information that makes a performance of my duty easier mm. will not be met with punishment. Oh, 
<laughs> Jesus. You're sheltering enemies of the state, are you not? That's why you hire Christoph Waltz. Yeah. You're sheltering them underneath your floorboards, aren't you? Yes. Point out to me the areas where they're hiding. They're just going to shoot through the floor. Since I haven't heard any disturbance, I assume while they're listening, they don't speak English. The open now, hey. Yeah. Oh. Au revoir, Shoshana. Oh, let her go away. Well, goddamn, hey. Told you I don't like him. That's why. One of the best scenes in any Tarantino oh. movie. My name is Lieutenant oh. Aldo Rain, and I'm putting together a special team, and I need me eight soldiers. Eight Jewish American soldiers. Each and every man under my command owes me 100 Nazi scalps. Oh, and, I and I want, want my, my scalps. scalps. <laughs> nein, 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 nein. Was alles alles von diesen Juden zu sein, wenn er hat haben. become a meme. Oh, is it? Nein, 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 nein. Bekannt als Bärenjuden. Ist von jetzt an nie mehr als Bärenjude zu bezeichnen. Ja, mein Führer. What? Oh, good God. Yep. Oh, okay. These are the good guys. Yep. Oh, so it's already happened. So yes. he's recounting. Okay. Yep. How's your English, Warner? Because need be, we got a couple fellas can translate. Wiki Air, an Austrian Jew got the fuck out of Munich while the getting was good. Came American. Got drafted. Come back to give y'all what? <laughs> what for? Sergeant Hugo Stiglitz. Oh, what's his name? Till Schweiger. That's his real name? Yep. Oh. He killed 13 Gestapo officers. Oh, yeah. Where do we know him from? He was in the second Tomb Raider movie with Angelina Jolie. Yes, there you go. Yeah. One of them. Yeah. He was also in King Arthur with oh. Clive Bowen. Is that Samuel L. Jackson narrating? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> we just want to say we're a big fan of your yeah. work. <laughs> big fan, Don't big fan. Nazis. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Besides you, we know there's another crop patrol fucking around here somewhere. So if you ever want to eat a sauerkraut sandwich again. <laughs> well, that's just racist, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I respectfully refuse, sir. Hear that? You might know him better by his nickname. The Bear Jew. Ooh. The one that even has Hitler shaking in his boots. Yeah. That's phone said nobody's allowed to ever say it again. No. Yeah. Guys, yeah. German here wants to die for country. Oblige him. On the one hand, you gotta admire his courage. Oh, of course. I knowing mean, he's about to die. Why would but... you expect anything different, really? I mean. Yeah. Oh, Eli Roth. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he really bulked up for the for this role. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Something to point out on this map to German position. Then zeig uns auf der Karte, wo die deutsche Stellung ist. <laughs> Ihre Einheit geriet in einen Hinterhalt, sie konnten fliehen. Kein weiteres Wort! Das ist really high blood pressure, hey? I mean, you know, the cocaine and all the psychosis never yeah, helped. Yeah, yeah, right. You take off that uniform, ain't nobody gonna know you's a Nazi. And that don't sit well with us. So I'm gonna give you a little something you can't take off. Hmm. German night in pair. Hmm. Ah. Four years. Qu'est-ce qu'il y a à partir de demain? Un festival Max Linder. Oh. 
J'ai toujours préféré Lender Hatchet. Tell me if you recognize him. Oh yeah, what? Uh, from where? This is Daniel Bruhl, otherwise known as Baron Zemo. Baron Zemo? Marvel. Ah! Oh! Him, okay, yeah, got it. This wow. th this is the movie that really kind of introduced him to Western audiences. Ah. North American. Mademoiselle, je me présente. Frédéric Sola. Hey, Freddy. How you doing? <laughs> I gotta go back to work. Go away. Cancer <laughs> cinéphile. Beau rêve, mademoiselle. Adieu. If he wants to win her over, start dancing like he did in the club. <laughs> Mm -mm. Yeah. <laughs> ah yeah. Trying to enjoy some private time. Je suis simplement d'être amical. Je ne suis pas votre ami. Pourquoi? Pourquoi? <laughs> das ist eine große Ehre, dich kennenzulernen. Eine große Ehre. Die Ehre ist ganz meiner Seite. Yeah. Alors comme ça vous êtes un héros de guerre. Qu'est-ce que vous avez fait? Some horrible thing you did and you're a hero for it. A German sniper. Aren't you lucky? 68. Le premier jour. 150. Le deuxième jour. <laughs> Et le quatrième jour ils ont quitté la ville. Peut-être un film sur vos exploits. Mm. <laughs> Et bien. C'est exactement ce que Joseph Goebbels a pensé. Bonne chance pour la première soldat. J'espère que tout ira bien pour Joseph et vous-même. Mademoiselle Mimieux. Mm. Oui. Now what? Yeah, because at any, any random moment, you know, they could come they for you and take do, you. Yeah. Or or ruin your business or bomb it or. And given burn what happened to her family. Yeah. And then you're left with nothing. Amerikanisches Olympia Gold. Look at that hat. Lässt sich mit Neger schweißen. A... <laughs> mm. Yeah, but that actress, uh, I believe she played Sophie in Kill Bill. Oh, the one who got her arm cut off. Oh yeah. Je n'étais pas sûr que vous accepteriez mon invitation. Yeah. The invitation. The Dr. Goebbels, Mademoiselle Francesca Mondino. <laughs> Bonjour. Certain things you just need brain bleach for. Yeah. So you'd never see again. Soldat Solar a passé l'heure du déjeuner à essayer de convaincre Monsieur Goebbels d'abandonner ses projets pour l'avant-première de son film et de changer d'endroit. Oh. Sie werden sich gar nicht drum kümmern müssen, den Saal zu füllen. Man wird sich um die Plätze reißen. Außerdem zum Teufel mit den Franzosen. Das ist ein deutscher Abend. Eine deutsche Veranstaltung. Meanwhile, she's thinking, please get me the hell out of yes. here. Yes. <laughs> and what is he saying? She's thinking, because. The most uncomfortable table you'd ever sat at, probably. Uh, pretty much. Ah, Landa! Da sind sie ya! Oh! Oh, shit! Emmanuel, voici le colonel SS Landa. Il sera chargé de la sécurité pour la... Oh! But her name is different, right? Yep. Oh, oh God. God damn. I have seen this movie, like, over a dozen times. I'm still terrified. Where's Brad Pitt? I need to see more Brad Pitt. Uh. <laughs> Müssen Mademoiselle Mimieux oder ich uns auch machen? Hans, der Junge wäre jetzt nicht böse. Er hat sich verkauft in die Kleine. Und er hat recht. I love how they're keeping the camera on Yes. Her. And actually, uh, Melanie Laurent, the, the actress, her mm -hmm. grandfather survived the Holocaust. Oh. Uh, pour moi, un café serré. Et pour la demoiselle, un verre de lait. Shit. Mm-hmm. But how does he know? Because she has a different name, right? Well... I mean, he knows a lot of stuff, He can probably. just be that, you know, intuitive. That looks really good, actually. Mm -hmm. A little bit of food porn to... Yeah. <laughs> ...distract from the terror. Yeah. Connaissant le ministre du Reich comme je le connais, je ne voudrais pas que la réussite ou l'échec de son illustre soirée dépendent de la prouesse d'un être. Mm -hmm. Ce que je voulais vous demander... Mm. 
mais maintenant, sur ma vie, un peu plus. <rire> bon, ce ne devait pas être important. Oh. Je pense qu'ils font des ashtrays pour ce very purpose. Yes. <sighs> This poor woman. <laughs> oh, yes. Great, we've got all the effing Germans coming now. Mm-hmm. Eh. Hey. Putain, on est censé faire quoi? This. <laughs> De remplir le cinéma de nazi et de le détruire par le feu. There you go. <rire> Collection de 350 films nitrate de Madame Mimieux. At that time, 35mm nitrate film was <rire> so <rire> flammable that you couldn't even bring a reel onto a streetcar. Because nitrate <rire> film burns three times faster wow. than paper. Yeah. Shoshana has a collection of over 350 nitrate films. Oh, this is going to be good. Yeah. Well, where's Brad Pitt? I, I thought he would be the one doing all this stuff. Well, he's out of the country, coming... killing any soldiers he can find. Yeah. And how appropriate, a black man and a Jewish yes. woman is plotting this. There he is. Who's that? Michael Fassbender. Oh. Oh, geez, is that Churchill? Right? If you offer me a scotch and plain water, I could drink a scotch and plain water. Mm. Make it yourself like a good chap, will you? The bars and the glare. You know who that is, right? Mike Myers. Yeah. What? Yeah, oh. baby. <laughs> With a British accent. Oh yeah. What should we drink to, sir? Well, um Down with Hitler. <laughs> All the way down, sir. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> is that a statue a behind of Churchill? Of the 20th. <laughs> I guess. And the Jewish controlled dogma of Hollywood. Mm. How's he doing? Oh, no. Not a statue. <laughs> brief him. Lieutenant Hickox, at this point in time, I'd like to brief you on Operation Keen Air. Joseph Goebbels is throwing a gala premiere for one of his new movies in Paris. What film, sir? The motion picture is called Nation's Pride. It'll be Goebbels, Goering, Bormann, And most of the German high command, including all high-ranking officers of both the SS and the Gestapo, we have all our rotten eggs in one basket. Love the basket. <laughs> And like the snows of yesteryear, gone from this earth. I do say, old boy, yeah. yeah. <laughs> They're very British. Yeah. Secret service outfit that lives deep behind enemy lines will be your assist. The Germans wow, the call them the bastards. Your contact is Bridget von Hammersmark. The German movie star is working for England. They'll have to get out before anything happens, obviously. The... Hmm. So it's the same plan that uh, oh, Shithana sure. has. Uh, same, same end result. Things prove eventful. I need to know we can all remain calm. You seem like a calm and reasonable person. If the moment calls for calm. Yeah, this was one of the movies that really made Michael Fassbender a star. Oh, yeah. yeah he's got quite a presence. So he far, does. Right? Does it say on the card? Oh, yeah. is it in German? I think so. Oh, there she is. Yeah. Oh, she's the actress. Okay. And it's funny, Diane Kruger is German, but she'd been living in America so long that she uh, lost an accent. Oh. She had to kind of relearn it for the movie. Oh, I bet, yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> uh. If I were in that scenario, I would be like Dopey in, in Snow White. I'd yeah. <laughs> run around to get a second 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 kiss. Neue Kino ist wesentlich kleiner als das Ritz. Welchen Sprengstoff ihr als für das Ritz mitgebracht? Jesus. Mm. Oh, great one. Yeah. Thank Thank Oh, that's the... Oh, no. Nobody's going to say anything to... Okay, go sit down. He's going to fall over, probably. He is properly hammered. Yeah. Come. The rüpelhaften Benehmen strapaziert. Aber sehr wohl die meine. Entschuldigen Sie, Herr 
Sturmführer, Sie haben einen sehr ungewöhnlichen Akzent. Hm. Sie müssen entweder betrunken sein oder völlig verrückt, dass Sie es wagen. Ich mache Sie und Sie verantwortlich. Sie greifen jetzt Ihren Freund oder er wird Max ersten Geburtstag wegen... Ja. Max's first birthday. Ich mich vielleicht erkundigen. Who is this? Was he sitting in the corner the whole time? Yeah, just reading, I guess. Woher stammen Sie, Hauptsturmführer? Sturmführer, ich finde es höchst... Ich habe nicht mit Ihnen gesprochen, Obersturmführer Münch. Ich spreche mit dem Hauptsturmführer heimatlos. Ich bin in einem Dorf geboren, das im Schatten des Bits Palüli. Mich voll und ganz dafür verbürgen, was der junge Hauptmann hier behauptet. Sein Bruder sieht wesentlich besser aus als er. <lacht> <laughs> this is that major that picked up Shosana, took her to the restaurant. Oh. Sie sind der Begleiter von Fräulein von Hammersmark. Irgendjemand muss ja ihr Feuerzeug tragen. There's so much fakeness that has to go on, right? <laughs> Auf trinke ich. Königin <laughs> Christ. Yeah. You start growling in a minute. Yeah. Wie wär's, wir spielen es auch? Ja, gerne. Ein Spiel. Wunderbar. Und kleben Sie sich vorne an die Stirn. Is <laughs> you don't want to play no games? Nope. Oh, Jesus. Bin ich Deutscher? Nein. <laughs> Bin ich Amerikaner? Nein. <laughs> Na ja, ja, geht noch. Ich bitte dich jetzt. War dieser Besuch erfreulich? Nicht für Sie. Not for you. <lacht> Als ich in Amerika ankam, wurde ich da in Ketten zur Schau gestellt. Ja. Bin ich die Geschichte des Negers in Amerika? Uh. Nein. Also dann muss ich King Kong sein. Ah! Oh. <lacht> Prost! Ja. Hm. Uh, yeah. <lacht> <lacht> oh. <lacht> uh. Erik, der 33er und frische Gläser. Drei Gläser. No, uh oh, what did he do wrong? The way he said that, I thought maybe he did something wrong. <laughs> what? Haben Sie das gehört? Das ist das Geräusch meiner Walter, die direkt auf ihre Hoden gerichtet ist. <laughs> Weil Sie sich eben verraten haben. Hauptsturmführer. He did something right with the three fingers. Or... Ich wollte sagen, dann sind mm. wir zu zweit. Like we saw in The Great Escape, yeah. the simplest thing can give you away. Ja, yeah, so, ja. Yeah. Und ab jetzt sind wir zu dritt. Und auf die Entfernung bin ich ein richtiger Frederik Zoller. Hm. Mm. How are we gonna do this? Yeah. Well, if this is it, old boy. <laughs> There it is. I hope you don't mind if I go out speaking to kings. <laughs> Stiglitz. See how feeders into your Nazi boss. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Everybody died. They? Looks like. Isn't that the new dad left there? Yep. You outside, who are you? British, American? What? We're American. Oh. Uh. Is there anybody alive on our side? No. I'm alive! Behind that, you dirty spotter! Who's that? It's the girl on your side? I'm here, Willie. I want to trust you. But. but... Unless you're half drunk. <laughs> oh, it's like, oh. You got guns on us. You decide to shoot, we're dead. Up top, they got grenades. They drop them down here, you're dead. That's a Mexican standoff, and that was not the deal. <laughs> <laughs> Just take that fucking traitor and get her out of my sight. Oh, she got him. Okay. So she's the only one that lived? Well. Is she the only one that lived? Oh, what the hell? Yep. It's called suspicious. Everybody needs to calm down. You're letting your imagination get the better of you. 
Damn it, that would hurt. Yeah. He ordered three glasses. We order three glasses. That's the German three. Uh, the other looks odd. It's those little cultural oh, yes. idiosyncrasies, you know. And when you're in it, you don't think to... You can't go through all the possibilities, right? Yeah, like the way you smoke a cigarette, mm -hmm. the way you drink, you know. There have been two recent developments regarding Operation Kino. I think, wasn't she about to say that the Fuhrer's gonna come? Because she got out the words, partly. The Fuhrer is attending the premiere. Oh, yeah. Fuck a duck! <laughs> <laughs> and you got a good how I broke my leg mountain climbing story. That's German, ain't it? Y'all like climbing mountains, don't you? I know. I like smoking, drinking, and ordering in restaurants. But I see your point. <laughs> Can you Americans speak any other language than English? We both speak a little Italian. It's an atrocious accent, no doubt. That poor guy that owns it or whatever's in his nightcap. Yeah. <laughs> Hugo. And there, I still have Vicky. Die beiden deutschstämmigen Mitglieder der Bastards. Hmm. Her shoes. Bridget von Hammersmark. That's not good. No. But it's okay because no matter what happens with this group, they've got it covered in the theater anyway for the yep. plan. <laughs> You'll be doing the world a great service. But an easier way would be like to poison the popcorn or mm -hmm. the drinks or well not there's no would do it. no guarantee that everyone yeah, orders true. the same yeah, thing. Yeah, that's true. That's a good song to go along. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> She's got her war paint. Yeah. I always thought those looked neat. Yeah. I mean, usually women are were wearing them for funerals and stuff, but... Mm-hmm. Oh, in a way, she's going to one. That's right, yeah. <laughs> you will never find a more wretched hive of <laughs> scum and villainy. Yeah. Fräulein von Hammersma. Hmm. Also, was ist mit ihrem wunderschönen Bein geschehen? Ich habe mich... Dummerweise muss ich eingestehen, im Bergsteigen versucht. Jetzt beim Bergsteigen? Ob sie es glauben oder nicht. <lacht> Weird to laugh at. <lacht> well, considering it's also a cover, you know. Yeah. Smart guy like him. Yeah, he knows because she was there. Her shoes were there. Bestiegen yeah. gestern Nacht. So it's like, really? You're going to go with that? Like, it was so, yeah, ri yes. so ridiculous yeah. that he... Yeah, I caught that, yeah. And wo genau in Paris ist dieser Berg? Yeah. Because mm. I don't think there's any mountains near Paris that you would, like, no. climb on. Hervorragende Sensationsdarsteller Enzo Gorlong. Ein sehr talentierter Kameramann, Antonio Margheriti. And Antonio... Dominique de Coco. <laughs> Bonjour. Oh no. Signorine. Oh my god. Piacere. Gli amici <laughs> della vedeta ammirata da tutti noi questa gemma proprio. And Landa speaks Italian. Oh. Una per la durata del loro soggiorno. Grazie. Oh my god. Lo pronuncio correttamente? See, uh, Greto. Oh no, he's <laughs> lied. He's so lied about speaking Italian. Travolta, ma adesso vorrei proprio sentire la musica delle parole. Margarete. E lei? Dominic de Coco. Come? Dominic de Coco. Bravo. Bravo. I think that actor speaks Italian in real oh, life. Okay. Or is Italian. Arrivederci. Arrivederci. Lordy. It's so That's bad. bad. Really bad. <laughs> uh. 
Oh, they're realizing who's there. To quote Henry Jones yeah. Sr., we are pilgrims in an unholy land. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she is quite fetching in that mm -hmm. dress. And as they say, the female is the deadlier of the species. That's right. Oh. Oh. dürft ich Sie unter vier Augen sprechen? Natürlich. Scusi un attimo. Ribadarchi. Legen Sie Ihren Fuß auf mein Schoß. I would say why. Oh, he's got the shoes. Of course, we're doing the foot thing here. Very mm. close up. Yep. Did somebody keep an eye on Tarantino when he was filming these, <laughs> the feet scenes? Hmm. Ran out with the heel and hit him in the head. <laughs> Voila. Just like Cinderella. What's that American expression? <clears throat> if the shoe fits, you must wear it. Was jetzt Oberst? Shit. Yeah. Jesus, he's just. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. And for that scene, those were Tarantino's hands. Oh. And it was to the point where she actually passed out when they filmed it. Oh, geez. Well, she looked a little. Oh no. Uh. I have the the public place. I should have taken a moment. Thank you, Hans. Alas, you're now in the hands of the SS. My hands, to be exact. Nice! <laughs> 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 Oh no. Are we gonna kill Brad Pitt? Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yep, that's the thing about Tarantino. Never know who's gonna live yeah. or die. As of this moment, both Omar and Donowitz should be sitting in the very seats we left them in. All I have to do is pick up this phone right here, inform the cinema, and your plans kaput. If I do nothing, it's as if I'm causing his death even more than yourselves, wouldn't you agree? I guess so. If you want to win the war tonight, we have to make a deal. Ooh, that's a bingo! <laughs> Is that the way you say it? That's a bingo? You just say bingo. Bingo, yeah. Bingo! How fun! <laughs> Over there is a very capable <clears throat> two-way radio, and sitting behind it is a more than capable radio operator named Herman. Get he calls them all Herman. Oh, well, that's for curious. Mm-hmm. Ah. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> They're all looking. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, no. <laughs> uh. This is the film they made, right? I think the so. The fourth one he said, I think, was Yeah. There. Whoa. That. Yeah. So when the military history of this night is written, it will be recorded that I was part of Operation Kino from the very beginning as a double A. Uh, what the hell's he doing? I want my full military mm -hmm. pension and benefits. He's jumping my ship. Proper rank. Ah. I want to. I want all the members of Operation Kino to receive the Congressional Medal of Honor. <laughs> 
I would like the United States of America to purchase property for me on Nantucket wow. Island as a reward for all the countless lives I've saved. There was once a Nazi on Nantucket Island. Yeah. Yes, yeah, sir. Colonel Lander will put you and Private Yudovich in a truck as prisoners. Then he and his radio operator will get in the truck. We've seen him before in Tarantino. Oh, yeah, Michael Madsen. Nope. Oh, uh, yeah. You will then take over driving of the truck. Oh, Harvey Keitel. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't seem to enjoy his own movie. Well, it's one long movie of just where he, he shoots shooting everyone. Harry, but yeah. <laughs> Ugh. She's going to have to kill him separately. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm kind of busy. No. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Don't forget to Hashtag nice guy. Good girl. Don't have time for this shit with you. And there's all kinds of shooting in the movie. Yeah, that's right. Nobody would hear it. <laughs> Just would not go away. Like that other guy at the table, right? Yeah. Don't go near. He'll grab you. Yeah. What the fuck? Hmm. Oh, no. God damn it. It's the one part of the movie that makes me angry. Because all the other people who die, they're like soldiers. Yeah. Or, but, you know, more than anyone, she deserved to live. Yeah. And killed by him, of all people. Yeah, that's right. Well, what's his name's there? He's going to light up that stuff, right? Marcel. Jump by you. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. And now nobody hears anything again. Yep. The best of him this year. Duck. Oh, oh. Jesus. Duck. Yep. I have a message Ooh, from Germany. That you are all going to die. Revenge of the giant face. I want you to look deep into the face of the Jew who is going to do it. I don't know there you go. Hurry before somebody. <laughs> oh, that was cool. Yes, very she cool. She wasn't alive to see it, unfortunately. But no. There you go. But she got her vengeance. Yep. <gasps> they killed Hiller. That this isn't real, but yeah, we get to imagine it. Yeah, yeah for that's a right. That's right. <laughs> nice. Mm hmm. Yeah, boys. Like fish in a barrel. Yeah. Wow, I wonder if they filmed that, eh? Yeah. That's still here. That's cool. You can yeah. see her in the smoke. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah. Ooh. Wow, got all of them anyway. Yep, they sure did. But it's crazy nobody else will know what happened, really, right? That they. Yep. I'm gonna shoot him. Oh, Herman again. It's always Herman. <laughs> I'm officially surrendering myself over to you, Lieutenant Rain. You the bitch cuffed Colonel's hands by his back. Slave to appearances. Oh! Scalp Herman. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think they were gonna go through this. You'll be shot for this! Oh. Nah, I don't think so. More like chewed out. I've been chewed out before. <laughs> chewed out. <laughs> when you get to your little place on Nantucket Island, 
I imagine you won't take off that handsome looking SS uniform of yours. Ain't you? I'm gonna give you a little something you can't take off. Uh, uh -huh. What have they done to all the survivors right of their attack? Right on their attack? forehead, right? Yeah. Oh. oh, Jesus. Oh. That, would hurt. that would so hurt. Yep. I'm out for a day and a half when I get a paper cut. <laughs> oh. Nope. Oh. oh. You want something, you bitch? I think this just might be my masterpiece. <laughs> oh, that was excellent. Wasn't it? Yes. Except for her dying. That was tough. Like I say, that's the part that I that I, I wish that she had lived, but Yeah. But yeah, Inglorious Bastards. That was good. Yep. I like quite, that. Quite quite excellent. Yeah. A lot of people consider this his best album. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> The Italian crap. <laughs> Gorlami. <laughs> it, it's become a meme since then. It's like, Gorlami. <laughs> oh, Bongiorno. Like, it's it's funny. What else did they smile like idiots when he's talking <laughs> in Italian to them? Yeah, well, it's funny because Hans Landa, like, it, first off, Christoph Waltz is a fucking oh master God. class. He, absolutely, yeah. Like, he yeah. got an Oscar for this role. Yeah. And it was well deserved. I mean, that opening scene alone earned him the Oscar. Like, with just how. Like, oh, he won an Oscar for this. He did. Wow. Yeah. And it, it, he really announced himself by storm to North, North American audiences mm -hmm. with this performance. Yeah. And it's funny because Tarantino spent, I think, like 10 years working on the script. It was a long process. And he had a hell of a time trying to find a German actor who spoke German, French, and Italian. Uh, he just yeah. could not find anyone. Yeah. But like an angel from the heavens, <laughs> Christoph Waltz came and answered his prayers. Well, and to speak it properly and not, right, with the with the accent and everything and not just be he's, all butchering it, In right? real life, he's yeah. fluent in all three yeah. languages and English. Tell, and, and, fluent, yeah. Yeah, and he's just such a delight. Like, that first scene, you know, like you were saying, yeah. it's... It, Nothing was happening at first, and you're still tense. Oh, yeah. He, stress. So stressed. He's threatening by how... Because I saw like, him in Tarzan, I know he's capable of something. He's threatening by, by how, like, disarmingly charming he is. Mm -hmm. And then when he does that turn, when he goes... Yes. You're sheltering enemies of the state. Yeah. Like, just that little turn. It's oh, like yeah. beautiful piece of acting and he with his face. And every scene he's in, I'm just, like, entranced by his performance. Yeah. No, excellent. Yeah, and, yeah, Brad Pitt, everyone yeah, else did really everybody well. Everybody else did well, yeah. Yeah, and th this is sort of... I thought somehow there might be a crossover to where they had an inkling of what they're planning. Right. The so plans that, would come yeah, together. Yeah, so that it's like nobody will ever know, and yeah. Yeah, but it, there's two connected universes for Tarantino. One is the one is the universe of real life, so stuff like Reservoir Dogs mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. and then Pulp Fiction. Yeah. And then there's the the sort of, I can't remember the name of, of it, but it's like the the universe where like the movies that people in those movies would watch. Right. So the guys in Pulp Fiction, like they would go see stuff like this or Kill Bill. Yeah. This is kind of the start of that one universe because oh, okay. killing Hitler in a theater makes like pop culture focused on violence in cinema. Mm -hmm. So that's why so many people like are say like quoting movies, loving yeah, movies yeah. in this hyper violent world. And yeah. But it's it's just a it's a wonderful piece of, of alternate history. You know, well, we, didn't you say that the other movie, one of the other movies, is about the Manson family or something? That's the so same thing. It's like a re. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So it's this what is what we wish would happen, or uh, what, yeah, well, an alternate. Yeah. Especially in this case. Yes. <laughs> just seeing Hitler get like oh, hamburgered just been by well, and all the high up guys, right? They, all of Nazi yeah. high command, all of them just roasted. Yeah. 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 I mean, you know, when when people think of this movie, you know, three scenes come to mind: the mm -hmm. opening scene of the farm, mm -hmm. the tavern when everyone gets killed, and then when Hitler yeah. dies. Yeah. Th those first two are just master classes in tension. Yes. Because oh, you yeah. like, you know, I've seen this movie before, but those scenes, I'm still, I feel mm -hmm. my, like stressed. I'm, yeah. I'm so tense. Yeah. And then you know, Landa is such a, and actually, I think Tarantino himself considers Hans Landa like the greatest character he's ever created. Really. Oh. You know, just before the writing, but also just for how well how well Christoph Waltz like portrayed him. Yeah, you know, he steals the show from everyone oh, when yeah, he's on for screen. Sure. Yeah, yeah, it's it's just. So a... he's still going to get to go to Nantucket Island. He's going to have a big swastika on his forehead. He shall. <laughs> yep, something he can't take off. Yeah, here you go. Here yep, you go. kept his word that way. Yeah, yeah. That's so too bad all those guys died, right? That... Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, Michael Fassbender had a smaller part yeah. than we thought. Yeah, right. I I just assumed that they maybe they would get wounded or. 
you know, in all that craziness. But and geez, the way he killed uh, Diane Kruger. Yeah, that was very, very intense. And yeah. because it's so it like very graphic, up close and personal. Well, because like he because in when they were filming, Tarantino had his hands around her throat. He was oh actively God. strangling her. You know, he got her permission and said yeah. he explained it all beforehand. And she said she would go through with it. It's disturbing because of how realistic it yes. is. Yes. Like, like he's actually yeah. choking her out and she passed out when they were filming. Yeah. That's why it looks. Because a lot of times when someone's being choked, they'll show the person doing the choking. Yeah. Right. And that intensity. But this was all her face. And it was. Yes. Ooh. Yeah. No, I really enjoyed that one. Yeah. It's good. Because other yeah. Tarantino films, even like my favorites, there's uh, or ones I like more. There's there's certain scenes I like more, certain scenes I like less. But this is one of those movies where I find almost every scene fascinating mm -hmm. in one way or another. Agreed. Yeah. Yeah, but but the um, Michael Fassbender, Daniel Bruhl, who played uh, Frederick, uh, mm -hmm. Christoph Waltz, and uh, Melanie Laurent, like those four, really kind of like announced themselves to like oh, American yes. audiences yeah. with this film. Even her, she didn't have a lot of dialogue, right? Not but a whole her lot. Eyes were so intense. Yeah. Like gaze, at the restaurant, yeah. like when when Landa shows up, like the and he's talking mm -hmm. with Frederick, the camera stays on her face. Yeah. And we see Worth like it. her trying to like keep her terror in inside. Yeah, it's too bad she didn't get. I mean, she got. The satis oh well, okay she got the satisfaction of yeah. the theater but not with him no no there was but it's nothing there yeah. and 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 landa himself will also like one of, one of the things that makes him so cool for a character as a character is his like intelligence he's like mm -hmm. a, like himself he said yeah. he's a detective yeah he's like sherlock holmes yes but his skills his deductive reasoning are sort of applied for darker purposes mm -hmm. he's a lot like uh grand admiral thrawn in that same way right yeah. because timothy zahn when he wrote thrawn he made him be like sherlock holmes if mm -hmm. he were more like evil or darker you know using his wits to like yeah. suss out the heroes and everything and yeah. that's why it, it's part of what's so funny is at, at the theater when like you know she says that she you know, broke her leg mountain climbing and all the bad yeah, Italian. Like yeah. he's a ma he's a man of supreme intelligence and wit, mm -hmm. but it's such a bad cover. It is, and that, that's yeah. Like, I realized that's why he was laughing. It was like, and, and to him, it's almost insulting that like yeah, the, this is like yeah. this is what they came up with. Yeah, that's why he's like laughing his ass off. He's but like, what he said, fell down the stairs or, or something. something. And like Simpler, I said, like the was... mountains of Paris. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Stuff like that. But it's just even when like and one of my favorite lines is, "Ooh, that's a bingo." Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> again it's become like a huge meme since then yeah. but it's it's like you just say bingo like yeah. there's a lot of lines from this that have become kind of ingrained in pop culture yeah, yeah. but yeah christoph waltz his first time with tarantino he knocks it out of the park a lot of great performances yeah I, I as you can tell i love this movie quite a lot as i'm sure all of you do so thanks once again for joining us if you want to check out the full length of our reaction i'll put a link down to our patreon below check out this and all the other movies and shows that we do a lot of exclusives like ted lasso on our patreon that aren't on youtube check those out we're having a real fun time with that yeah stuff like parks and rec and uh yeah we will see you later bye guys bye